Select the images that you want to rename and choose Tools, Start Rename Tool. From the four drop-down menus at the top of this page, you will select what you want your new file name to be. In the first three, you can choose a sequence number, the original file name, the shooting date and time, or something that you make up yourself. Down in these windows, we see the original file names and the new modified file names. Under Basic Settings, you can sort the files by the way you've previously arranged the files in the main window, by file name, or by shooting date and time. If you've been shooting RAW plus JPEG and viewing them as separate files, you can ask the Rename tool to give the corresponding RAW and JPEG files the same name by clicking this box. Click the Next box and the files will keep their original names and a new set of copied and renamed files will be created in a specified location. Under Format Settings, you will choose to a sequence number and whether or not you'd like that sequence number to be saved. These next drop-down menus allow you to choose the date and or the time and how they appear in the file name. Click Insert Underbar to separate the different components of the new file name. And when you're ready, click Execute and the renaming takes just seconds.